And on this Adam and Rachel's very special day, I'd like to welcome you all to this wonderful venue, Lulworth Castle. To my darling Rachel, the soon to be Mrs. Harris, you are truly the most thoughtful and caring person who brightens up each and every day. You've always picked me up if I've ever had a bad days with that big smile and big heart. <laughs> We've been on an incredible journey together from the first time we met in Chicago <laughs> to saying, does that mean we're boyfriend and girlfriend <laughs> in Mary Jane's up London? To amazing holidays to becoming my beautiful wife. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you with all my heart. Love Adam. That one's got me. That one's got me. <laughs> Boom. Amazing. To my dearest darling Adam, my soon to be husband, happy wedding day. I never thought in my wildest dreams I would be fortunate enough to find someone as handsome, kind, funny, caring and compassionate as you. And yet somehow I have been lucky enough that you are now marrying me. When I sit here and look back at the past eight and a half years we've known each other, I'm incredibly proud of what we've achieved together. We have experienced many life milestones together from buying our first home, getting engaged and more recently finding our forever home. And while there's no doubt that we've worked hard for it, I've enjoyed working for it with you. I could not have asked for a better teammate in this game called life. Hi, I'm Abby, I'm Lady Bonner, and this is my first game of the day. You look beautiful, Rach. Yeah. You really do. So... <laughs> yeah. Oh, Rach. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> the home we have created for us is where I feel most safe and while we have been fortunate enough to have visited some amazing places over the years, there is still no place I'd rather be in this world than snuggled on the sofa. <laughs> I am so proud of you and all that you have done for us over the years and I am excited to see what the future holds for us. In case this letter has made you emotional, I have written a short poem to cheer you up. Roses are red, violets are blue, I'm crap at poems, boobies. <laughs> See you at the altar, baby. Lots of love from soon to be Rachel Harris. It's always good to be well liked by the in laws. I, Adam Harris, take you, Rachel Wendy Goodyear, to be my wedded wife. I, Rachel Wendy Goodyear, take you, Adam Harris, to be my wedded husband. Rachel, I'll give you this ring as a symbol of our marriage and as a reminder of the vows we have made here today. Adam, I give you this ring as a symbol of our marriage and as a reminder of the vows we have made here today. May these rings that form a visible seal to your marriage be a reminder to you both of the vows and promises you have made to each other here today. Let your rings be a sign that love has a past, a present and a future. Adam, and Rachel, value your love for one another. It is a gift. Take care of it, and it will last you a lifetime. You are two people with one life ahead of you, and in joining your lives through this marriage, may you both be granted a special lifetime together. It gives me great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. Congratulations to you both.
When Rachel was younger, she had an ambition to marry someone who was intelligent, witty and good looking. And then she met Adam. <laughs> so I guess we should all, all be thankful that her views changed over time or none of us, or none of us will be here today. But on a serious note, it's clear that Adam makes Rachel very happy and I'm really pleased for that. It's nice. And Adam and Rachel, I wish you both the very best life has to offer you. Unfortunately, none of my grandparents are here anymore. Rachel, you know how highly I speak of them and the memories I have. They would all be so proud of you and wonder how the hell I'm marrying so, well, married someone so pretty. You constantly make me laugh. We have had made so many fantastic memories so far and can't wait to see what else we can bring. Can you please raise your glass and toast to my wife, Mrs. Harris. Firstly, Willis and I would just love to say, Rachel, PKA Princess, you look amazing today and you've stolen the show. Adam is one lucky man. Having got to know Rachel over the last few years, I genuinely couldn't be more pleased for Adam and I couldn't be more amazed that Rachel has been willing to settle at such a low level by agreeing to marry Adam. Our sporting abilities and ambitions never came from our parents. Sorry, Mum and Dad. It actually came from a gentleman who we knew as Lenny Boy, our granddad. He was our role model. He'd have been so proud of you today. The man you become, but not only that, the lady that you've brought into our family. <laughs>